What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And this is day two of the vlog at Wookiees in the Woods family reunion. It is also, we are celebrating uh, the 20 years of the Volkswagen R32. Also, um, it is a great morning out here. The sun is shining. Um, me and Brett are gonna hop in the car. Um, we're gonna go to Robbinsville. We're gonna fill up on gas and then we are gonna go try to find a car wash. Um, I think Ant's going to meet us there once the other guys wake up. They should meet us there. But we're going to go uh, hit up a car wash and see what the day brings us. And you will be seeing it here on the vlog on day two. So stay tuned. Hey, Nick! What are we doing? Well, we've been here since Monday and it's been raining since Monday. Yeah. So today's now Friday and we're finally getting a car wash. And we're trying the Stealth Garage break by Mur from Tyler. But uh, we yeah, finally nice. found a car wash. It was about 20 miles away. And uh, <clears throat> I thought it said acid free. <coughs> next, so, time, next time, guys, press F the Paris We're finally going to get a car wash. Wheel cleaner? Ah, oh, dude, I ain't doing that. Yet. Okay, fine. <laughs> Oh yeah, back when she's clean. Thanks, Brett. You're welcome, Nick. All right, go for it. Here. Oh man, this thing's filthy, dude. Oh, shit. Oh, you got soap on it? I put a wash slash rinse. Yeah. Like I said, it's been raining since Monday. This thing is cake. Dirt, leaves, oh. dragon blood. Other broken cars blood. We're gonna get a nice wash. I know it's gonna rain later, but we're gonna get a nice wash on the R32. And then we're gonna go drive the dragon. We'll check in with you guys soon. Oh yeah, it's done. Alright, that copy there. Yeah. Oh. Well, we washed the car and we're off. Um, I'm not putting that dirty, molested, <laughs> dirty, molested horse hair wolf hair, horse and wolf and hair <laughs> brush on my car. Yeah, no way. So we wash it off. Now we're gonna go over there and park next to Tristan with the crooked turbo hand sticker. <laughs> Tell him to fix that so he doesn't look like a loser. <laughs> and then um, he's also missing an H. Yeah. Turbo, huh? Turbo and. Turbo and. Turbo and. So um, we're gonna go park over in the sun, uh, wipe it off, put some, uh, Nick's professional tire shine on because it's oh. the best tire shine in the world. Damn. And uh, yeah, we'll check in with you guys in a little bit. All right, let's get her dry. Look who's awake, everybody! We had a rough night, didn't we? <laughs> Daddy? <laughs> hold on, hold my camera. We're gonna hook you up with Stealth Garage Brake Bomber Non-Acid Wheel Cleaner that Tyler tells everyone works so amazing. Yeah, so how was the night? Wow, it's pretty good. Um, it was good. We had fun. <laughs> yeah, I bet you did. Um, <laughs> did you guys see the video of what I did to Scott? Or did you hear about it? No. <laughs> yeah, so Scott is downstairs on the porch down low, right? Mm -hmm. And I'm, I'm up top and I hear him talking, right? And I see the deck. I move the couch. I find the crack and I fucking just chug the water. Oh, shit. <laughs> Scott goes, oh, man. <laughs> You should have you should have heated up the water a little bit and said it was piss. Dude, he was so <laughs> mad. Yeah, we uh we demolished pretty much every beer in the house, I think, so. <laughs> yeah. It really needed this. I don't know what happened last night. 
Bro, it was like a thunderstorm. Yeah. I mean, I woke up and there was trees everywhere. Actually, I went down the road and I was like, hopefully no trees fell on cars. Yeah. Oh, we got the dragon! I went to go see the sunset with John. Yeah, I'll show yeah that too. I'll show you a time lapse. It was all right, but where we we went to where me, you, and Kyle went to the um, the solar eclipse. It didn't rise right. Exactly. Exactly. So I might go back tomorrow morning just to retry. Yeah. Just look right there. Well, we're gonna wash them up and then we're gonna hit the dragon. Push him in. <laughs> Push the dog in, Brett. Yeah, it's a guy with the tree. Come here, buddy. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come on. Oh, don't. Not on my. No. Come on. Come on. Brett. Back legs, Brett. Oh, my God, dude. It's also a two door, it's a tight spot. Come on, buddy. We're gonna bring you safety. Oh, yeah. Right, right, right. Just grab his back leg. Oh. Well, if you go, push me, it backs out. That's his problem. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna push me. I think he's honestly. Look at his house. 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 Look at his house.
What's up guys, just checking in. So currently we went to a rest stop over here to fill up to get gas. And um, we're not on a highway or anything like that. We're just at a busy intersection on the, one of the main roads in North Carolina. And um, this dog is running across the main road right here, about to get hit by a car, almost gets hit by a car, and comes up to me and starts kissing me. I don't have that kind of heart, but across the street was a fast food place. And uh, they said that somebody pulled up in a van at seven o'clock in the morning and just unloaded him and left. They didn't know what to do. We called animal control and they said if we bring it there, they're just gonna shoot it because they're completely full. Um, so I don't have that car, heart, kind of heart. So the current situation is I have the dog. We named him Turbo. Right, buddy? All right. So right now, we're gonna bring him to Wookiees in the Woods with us and we're gonna see if someone can be so kind enough to take him home. If not, I'm gonna have to take this dog with me because it's, the dog is too nice to let someone shoot it. I'm sorry. Um, that's not gonna happen today, buddy. But uh, we're gonna get going in a little bit and we'll check in with you guys soon and let you know what happened to Turbo. Right, Turbo? We're gonna find you a good home, buddy, okay? You love me? It's okay, buddy. We'll find you a good home. Guys, let me know, please. If anybody wants this dog um, at Wookiees, I'll even bring it home for you if you guys want it back home. Let me know. All right, guys, so little update. We found a sheriff station. So we're gonna bring Turbo over here. We bought him a leash at the dollar store, but we don't want them to put you down, buddy. Hey, hey, you good boy? Rat? Do you want to bring a dog home? Nope. Why? Uh, because that's a 14 hour car drive that I would really not appreciate. But you have a car that's perfect to hold him. Yes, I know. And that would be fun. Do you want to go home with Brett? Yeah. Do you want to go home with Brett? We already named him. Yeah, Turbo. Turbo Money Turbo instead money. of B Money. <laughs> Come on, you wanna come sit down on the bench? His tail is bloody. Really? Yeah, you can see right there. Oh, man. Yeah. Tristan? Yeah. What's the update? Uh, she said she's gonna go speak with the officer and see what he said. Oh, we ain't afraid to come out. All right, buddy. Little update soon, okay? Guys, we found him a home with the officer. He's got um, yeah, he's very, cut yeah, on his he's tail. Good. He's bleeding on his tail. His ears are bloody. Oh, he's, him play. Oh my goodness. He's playing. Like my mom said, when they roll on their back like that, that's the ultimate trust of a dog. I really wish, but my car yeah, my my male doesn't like other male dogs. So. You think he's like one though? Can we just I'm make just, him an officer? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. So, the update on Turbo, what Brett's doing right now is, Brett, what are you doing? Giving him some flea and tick? Yeah, a little flea and tick. You never know where he's been, what he's got going on. So. He doesn't tick. look like he has any fleas or ticks. He's not itching. He looks pretty clean. His teeth are very white. Um, like I said, somebody said they just got dumped off at 7 or 8 o'clock this morning. They didn't want him anymore. Who knows? But like I said, the police station said they're just going to put him down. And uh, we don't want that. So we're going to give him a good home. Good boy. Turbo? Turbo? All right, guys. So we just had dinner at Fontana. Aunt, what'd you have? Wings. You know what I had? What'd you have? A pretzel with beer cheese. What'd you have? I had a smash burger with fries. It was good. You're gonna get smashed. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> what happens at the Airbnb stairs? It stays the Airbnb. <laughs> yeah, Jesus. Right. 
<laughs> Tristan, what'd you have? Smash burger, baby. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Guys, this is, uh, this is currently nothing. I know there's cars here, but this is nothing. Wait until day three or day four of the vlog. Guys, look at... Tristan made it. He lost, so I think he lost one of his uh, canards right here. Lost this one. Yo, Turbo Hand made it too fast for you or what? <laughs> Guys, check out the Mark, uh, Mark 6 Golf R right here with the trailer done from the guys at P3. Check it out, another Mark uh, 6. But yeah, they made it into a trailer. Look at that. Dude, you gotta check out the inside. Take a nap. Hop in and take a nap. Everyone's testing it out. Dude! Relays. Check it out, guys. Mark Six Golf R. Trailer. Listen, it's a six and a half. Ah! Never had one of those, huh, Brad? No, yeah, but no. I just got a DC in I just didn't have time to get back power to that. So I'm gonna put a battery in the back. That's what do we got here? Charge your phone right here? What about yep. the <laughs> I have no idea what that is. Central electronic controller mod. It might not have that. So if you have that, you should be able to add power to it. Tristan, what do you think of the trailer? This is dope, bro. This is pretty dope. He said it's a Mark Six and a half. Get it? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, shit. All right, guys, we're going to go see what the guys are doing at the Airbnb. Catch you later, Ant. Day two here, Wookiees in the Woods. What are we doing, Nick? We're tagging up the uh, Dragon Store. Yeah, what do we got? We got a red, we got the brightest color <laughs> for the wall. Perfect. Want to stand out a little? That's right. Where are we going to put it? Right here. That's right. Nice and bright. And if you guys see this video and you come down to the dragon and you see the sticker and the sticker's still here, make sure you send me a picture. You can Instagram me at Mr. Turboham, obviously. Um, send me a picture. I want to see if it's still here. But this is what we're doing on day two. We didn't vlog because our hands were all dirty, but basically um, we got some breakfast and then one of our buddy's cars actually from Connecticut broke down. He was having some problems. So we spent pretty much, you know, the majority of the day helping him out. Um, we should have vlogged it, but unfortunately we're just trying to get it done. Um, and that's okay because it rained today. So we just helped him out, you know, try to get his car situated. Um, and now we're just, we stopped to get some, uh, stuff at the local store. We're gonna go back to the house and we're gonna see if Anthony is gonna throw down and cooking like he said he was going to. But. Oh yeah, there it is. Let oh. me know if you guys see it. That's it, there it is guys. Zoom out a little bit so you guys get some perspective here. It's right in between the two. As soon uh, as you walk in, look at the lamp and look at the sticker. That's it. Don't wait longer. Yeah. yeah. All right, Wookiees of the Woods. Sleep. We got the crew here. We made everybody uh, some penny of vodka with sausage and some garlic bread. Ant whipped this up, guys. Yep. Yeah, Family style. Look, my place even served. Yep. Every, everyone's is. <laughs> Family style. We're just waiting for Nick behind the camera to sit down. So All right, well, let's uh, hold on. Let's look at the messy bread. <laughs> 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 Don't talk about crap like that. <laughs> yeah, that That's authentic American cuisine. Is there any Red 40 in there? Any Red 40 really? <laughs> <laughs> Dude! Yeah, just some simple pasta feeds everybody. There's eight of us here. Rigatoni. So that way we can wake up tomorrow and have plenty of energy. No plenty way! Of energy. To drop the train! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> so guys, as you can see, we had a very interesting uh, day two. Um, we got Turbo here still. The update is um, we gave him uh, flea and tea med uh, tick medicine. He's got food. He's got water. He's safe. He's a good boy. He's just relaxing here at the porch on the Airbnb. Today was a very interesting day, but you know what? 
I wouldn't change it for the world, you know. Um, a lot of people would just let this dog go and uh, it, it wouldn't live in the wild out here in North Carolina. Um, and obviously the police didn't want to help us out at all. Um, they said that they would just put the dog down and the animal shelter was also full. Um, so they said they would put the dog down. The dog does not have a chip on it. So no, we cannot find the owner. And also the owner, um, there was a minivan supposedly, and they couldn't get the plate number, but abandoned the dog at 8 a.m. at the restaurant that it was at, that it came up to my car around 10 or 11 a.m. after we left the car wash when it came up to my car. Um, so they just left the dog there. So, um, a couple of people said it looks too good to be a stray, you know, which it probably was a house dog, but I don't know what those people were going through, but they just, aban they just decided to abandon the dog. Um, the only way we're going to take this dog home, uh, with us back to Connecticut is if we could not find it a home tomorrow on day three, um, we would have liked to enjoy Skyway Highway and the dragon and the raffle and everything else that's going to happen tomorrow on day three. But um, the way I am, we need to find this dog a home before any of that happens. Um, I'm not too worried about enjoying anything else other than find this dog a home before um, I enjoy anything else. So we are going to, it looks like North Carolina is not that big of a help. So we're going to go to Tennessee, see if we could find a dog rescue shelter that can take the dog home. If the dog cannot find a home, obviously we will be bringing it back to Connecticut where I have a numerous amount of offers that will take the dog home and that will uh, fix it and run blood work and make sure the dog gets a very good home. But um, there might be other strays and rescues out here, but no matter what, this dog is not going to a random home. What's that? How's it going? Hey. What's going on? How are you doing? Are you so sweet? Yeah, he's a good boy. Are you a good boy? So we'll keep you updated on day three's vlog, but that is the end of day two. And Turbo's in good hands. And he's rescued. We're still having a good time down here, but now we have a little bit of a... Hey, good boy. He's a very good boy. <laughs> Look at you. Your name is Turbo? Are you a good boy? Oh my goodness. Stay tuned for day three to find out where this dog goes. Keep you guys updated. Catch him with you later.